Hello, hello, everybody. Man, I am just getting in here by the skin of my teeth. I had to do a, a video right before this live and we've just gotten it up and shared and what have you. So um, I am so sorry I'm like a minute late, but um, hello, everybody. I hope you guys are doing well. I am doing well, just Busy, busy. People thought I'd be bored when I retired. I was talking to Debbie Rice earlier and I was like, I am not bored. I'm not bored at all, actually. Um, hope everyone is having a great day. I'm so glad to see all of you. Let me scroll up to the top and say hello to everybody. Lee is here. We can officially start the live because he has come in and set up. I know we got pretzels, marshmallows and fruit for everyone. Welcome to the Principal Painter. Help yourself. Um, YouTube ate the first attempt. I'm sorry. The first post keeps disappearing. Well, uh, it's, it's here now, Lisa. You're good. Hi, Joe. Welcome. Welcome. Diamonds and Doxies. Hello. Tammy. Hi. Linda and Shell. Hi. Nikki. Hello. Spunky Red. Hello. John. Hi. How are you? Sarah and Kim got a new groove. Canine Mama, Robin Pennington is in the house. Hello. Hi, Daisy. Sean, glorious day in mid-Michigan. Yes, I have heard from a couple of friends in Michigan, and they said today was very nice. You guys deserve it after that winter you guys had. Uh, let's see. Hi, Catherine, 197. Allison, hello. Christine, hi. Oh, Florida. Yay. I know it's nice in Florida. You guys have our weather, so yes. Anita, hello, also from Florida. Lots of lots of Floridian diamond painters. Marion, my future roomie, hello. Albuquerque, New Mexico. Oh, it's windy there, very windy. Uh-oh. Emma, hi. Happy little drills. Welcome. Esmeralda, hello. Crafting with Shay is in the house. Hi, Shay Shay. Barb T and Tina, hello, Jess. Hi, Diamonds and Decaf is in the house. Wow, we got a great bunch in here tonight. Sherilyn and Nora, Leopard Leatherworks is in the house. Hello, Carrie and Tim. Nora is making dinner. Hi, Jay Lily. Um, hey, y'all, the other Lee. <laughs> You know, we have, you know, double, double the fun with double Lee's. That's not a problem. Hi, Kelly. Welcome. Brittany's World. Hello, Jennifer. Hi. Uh, Tammy's watching her niece's softball game while being here. Oh, that's fun. Oh, I remember baseball with my boys. It was super fun watching, um, but oh my gosh, every single game. And then when they would play tournaments, it was a double-edged sword. So you're out there all day long and every game you're like, if they lost right now, we could go home. That's what you're thinking. And you feel like a terrible parent. Well, then you make it into the final game of that tournament and you're like, I have been sitting here all dadgum day long. They better win. So that was when we all went completely ballistic. So yeah. <laughs> uh, let's see. Heather. Hello. Hello, Pink Poodle. I just talked to Ashley. Actually, I was helping her pick yet another Dakota painting. I don't know. Have you picked the one? She gave me a choice of three to pick. And I, you know, I was having a hard time picking. Which one did you pick? I want to know. Anna's drawing channel. Hello. You're doing majesty. Yes. Uh, Della. Hello. Anne. Hi, Jen. It's so nerve wracking. <laughs> I know it is nerve wracking. Um, last week, I know basketball tournament, same kind of thing. You sit and you're like, okay, maybe we can go maybe. And then at the end, you're like, you better win this game. Cause I've been here the whole day. <laughs> uh, yep. Remember those days. Absolutely. Um, painting with the painter and friends, Sherry. Awesome. Well, welcome. Welcome. Like I said, it was kind of, oh, probably Hazel's world. That's so cute. I love that one so much. I am toggling back and forth between four diamond paintings. I'm toggling. I'm doing Majesty. So I finished Everest, so I'm doing Majesty as my second Dakotathon painting. I'm in the middle of a Hannah Lynn for Hannathon because my bestie Brandy is doing Hannathon. 
I am doing a Francesca's um, studio, which um, I'm having a great time with too. Um, Mindy of Mindy's Diamond Moment, my friend, is doing a Francesca event. And then I'm doing a Jaded Gem shop because they're doing Jaded Gemboree, and that's Adele. I love Adele. So I've been wanting to do this diamond painting for some time. So yeah, four diamond paintings I've got on the go. Um, and then I got contacted by Diamond Art Club. And now that it's out, I can share with you. None of you, you, you are all in here. Nobody leave right now. Um, but um, Diamond Art Club is going to be on QVC tomorrow. Um, they are uh, doing bundles. Um, so I got the landscape bundle. So it's two diamond paintings in a bundle that will be available for purchase at Diamond Art Club's hinted at it, discounted prices. So if you need gifts for first time diamond painters or want to rope a friend into diamond painting with you and they're not diamond painters, this would be perfect. You get two in a bundle and it's supposed to be discounted. A lot of these paintings you probably have seen before. Um, some have been on the site, some have been on Amazon. One of the ones I unboxed, it was a lighthouse and I hadn't seen it before. So y'all go watch after this live. Um, Brandy is not going live. Um, she got stuck at school. <laughs> her car wouldn't start, but her car has started. She has AC now. She's very happy, but she canceled her live because she didn't know what time she would be getting home. So, but anyway, the QVC bundle thing, it the video had to go out today. And so Marlon was working today. And as you know, he is my uh, cameraman. Yes. Thank you, Sherry. Yes. Uh, noon Eastern Standard Time is when these bundles go on the QVC uh, channel. And Angie, the founder of Diamond Art Club, is going to be the one on there sharing them. I just think it's awesome that Diamond Art Club has taken this to a national platform and sharing this craft with everybody. I just think it's awesome because um, I still don't y'all still talk to people about diamond painting. They look at you like you have five heads and go, what's that diamond paint? Never heard of it. And I'm like. It's been out for years now and people still don't know about it. So uh, kudos to Diamond Art Club for taking this to a national platform. I'm excited. So, yeah, it's 12 o'clock Eastern, which is 11 o'clock Central tomorrow uh, afternoon. So I just, you know, I just said in my video, um, they'll never ask it. But I asked, you know, we can go support them. They support us. They're supporting Dakotathon. They've given us um several $50 gift cards for this event. They, they do it for all the events. They're supporting our retreats and all kinds of things. So I'm, I'm just going to go get on and look and see what, what they've gotten and hear about it. You know, they sometimes take callers on QVC just to ask questions. So I'll be interested to see what they have to say about it. So yeah, it's exciting. Kids that have been up on the Amazon store. Yeah. Um, and again, this lighthouse, I could have missed it. I don't, I don't know, um, but I hadn't seen it before. And Marlon loved both of the kits. We may, we may, I'm not making any promises, but we may get Marlon to diamond paint. He has refused up until this point, but he saw those kits and like he talked in the middle of this video and said, I, I would do one of those. And I'm like, I'm about ready to pass out. I thought my breaking news was about DAC going to be on QVC. And then Marlon's like, yeah, I might do it. And I'm like, Oh my gosh. So fingers crossed, we may make a diamond painter out of Marlin. Let's see. Um, they answered my question in the Facebook group. Uh, these are kids that have been up. Okay. On the Amazon store. Yeah. But um, on the Amazon store, I think they're sold singly. These are, these are bundles. So there's an animal bundle. Um, Katie diamonds and washi put up a video of that one. I put up the video of the landscape one. Ah, uh, there's a floral bundle as well. I'm not sure who has the floral bundle video. I have not seen that one. So, um, We'll see. There are three different bundles. Hello, Christine. Welcome. Yeah, so I'm excited. But we just, Marlon got home at 4.30. We videoed, uploaded it, put it up. And um, Brandy had called to tell me about her car. And I'm just chit-chatting away. Like I got all the time in the world. And I'm like, oh my gosh, it's six o'clock. I got to go. Bye. <laughs> so it was funny. Anyhow, um, did Marlon hit his head? I know, Jen. I, I, he just saw these two and said, oh, my gosh, those would be great kits um, for beginners. And I like the kits, too, because, you know, there are some kits that are more for they're more kid based. They're for kids starting out diamond painting. But these are more, 
you know, adults could do them and not feel like they were starting out with a cartoon kind of thing or whatever. But um, he was very, and he was like, these two look great. So yeah. Hi, Marsha. Welcome. Welcome. So I know we, I thought he hit his head too, Jen, seriously. Anyhow. So that's my day. Again, people said you're going to be bored when you retire. I'm like, mm, no, no, that's not happening. So that's what I've been up to. Oh my gosh. Um, met with the committee. We've picked prizes. I will be announcing who won prizes tonight. So um, yeah, that'll be super fun. What else is going on? Oh, I did um, paint gem, had some restocks of their paint gem kits. Uh, I got, um, I got, Flowers 2.0. Hi, Sue Bell. I was just talking to Sue Bell. Sue Bell was a Michigan friend I was talking to about their weather, and she said it was it was nice. So um, they are nice size snack size kits. Yes, sometimes you need that after these big canvases or when you're toggling back and forth between four. So yeah, crazy. Um, but anyway, I got um, I got the flowers kit. Um, and the first flower floral kit um, was flowers, obviously, but the second kit has the flowers in vases. And so I got that kit. So I was excited to, to get that. And I'll have to share that on a, a small shop haul or just show it, you know, as is. So, yeah. Alyssa is in the house. Can we throw up just some confetti, some champagne, some fireworks for Alyssa? Today is tax day. Happy tax day. Hope everybody got their taxes done. Alyssa's an accountant, right? She's a diamond painting accountant. She's done with tax season. Hooray. So yeah, y'all put up some champagne bottles, some firecrackers, some fireworks for Alyssa. Whew, she deserves it. Um, I didn't know if she was going to be in here or not. I thought she might be celebrating. Maybe she is celebrating and she's in here. I don't know. <laughs> So congratulations, Alyssa made it through tax season. Woohoo! Uh, Diamond Queen 2020. Hello, welcome, welcome. So yes, uh, we did get our taxes in. So oh, she can't hear what's being said, but I'm here in the chat. I'll listen to the replay later. Yes, she's probably at. Yeah, there we go. We're we're. Can someone type in? We're throwing up champagne and fireworks for Alyssa. Um, <laughs> Oh, yes. Yes. Um, yeah. So uh, taxes, what are those? Uh Oh, it's the 15th of April. You've got to today's the day or uh, at least file an extension. Uh, if you did, if you, you didn't know today was the day. But anyway, um, yes, Tammy, uh, a lot of restock. So that's good. So hi, Tracy. Welcome. Welcome. So yeah, we have been planning um, Dakotathon stuff. I have been planning for our Crafters Paradise um, retreat. Uh, I swear y'all, I wake up at three in the morning and write stuff down that I think of. And I, I think of the most random things. Being busy, you just, and I did this when I was a principal too. You wake up in the night and you're thinking, these are the things that I think. So at retreats, you have like a photo area where people can stand and take selfies or take pictures with their friends at the retreat. So I got a backdrop. It's a really pretty mermaid scale backdrop for it. And I'm like, we need something extra. So my thought in the middle of the night, the other night, again, this is how random the thoughts are. I'm like, I need to YouTube how to make a balloon arch. We need a balloon arch for the photography area for the Crafters Paradise Retreat. So I'm literally YouTubing at 3.30 in the morning. Marlon wakes up and he's like, what are you doing? I'm like, I am uh, YouTubing how to make a balloon arch because we're going to have a picture area at the retreat. He's like, how do you think of these things? And I'm like, I don't know, sick brain. I'm just really strange. Anyway, hi, Melinda, welcome. Oh, she's two ranch waters deep in happy hour. <laughs> You deserve it, Alyssa. You have your ranch water and enjoy. So yeah, thought of that. Um, thought of, ooh, what kind of lanyards are we going to get for name tags? 
And then I remembered we really didn't want lanyards. I mean, just all these random things that are popping into my head. So yeah, but um, we had a great meeting as a committee yesterday. We uh, met and drew the names for the winners. And um, I don't know that a lot of people know the work that goes into just events and keeping, we keep spreadsheets because the bottom line is we want to make drawings fair for everybody. And we want to make sure we include everybody that's put a picture up for progress. And so um, Alyssa is a techno genius. And so she has helped us with our spreadsheets. So um, we, you know, have a spreadsheet, we go, and we check, put the name down. D did they do their picture for week two, all this kind of thing. But that's what I was busy doing yesterday. So I am not bored. So uh, balloon arches are easy. Fishing line and paper clips. Yeah. Um, yeah. Jessica, I'm glad you made it too. Welcome. Welcome. Uh, Melinda, if I have not said hello, hello, Melinda. So that's what I've been doing. Spreadsheets and, you know, no wonder I'm ADD. Can you see my life is making me ADD? I used to think my job made me ADD. No, it's my life. Just random stuff. So, yeah. Um, I have a proud mom moment to share. Proud mom moment. Of course, um, he didn't call to share this. Uh, Marlon left for work and he had contacted me and said, I may be late. And I'm like, no, 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 no. You can't be late. We have to do this video. I have to get it out today. It just, that's what we have to do. And he was like, oh, I'll try, Kara. I'll try. And I was like, okay, please get home. Well, I texted Blake, my youngest, and I said, are you working today? I said, I have a YouTube emergency. And he was like, no, I'm not working. But he said, I have a physical, I have uh, a psychological evaluation and so a couple of other things. And I'm like, did you get arrested, son? Like, are you in, the, are you in, you know, the slammer? What, what is going on? He was laughing. He said, no, mom. He said, I am so sorry. He goes, I didn't tell you. He goes, I've made it into the police academy. He wants to be a detective. So he made it into the police academy, took the test. Of course, I'm, I promise you, he is too smart to study and too cute to care. He didn't study, he didn't study at all. So he took the test and obviously passed it because he's made it into the police academy. So he's super excited. So he has to go do all this physical and psychological and all that kind of thing. So I'm like, congratulations. I am super proud of you. Um, you probably barely scraped in based on your antics in high school. Uh, did they check your background? Uh <laughs> He was like, mom, <laughs> it was funny. So I sit here once again and go, can either of my children um, get a safe job? Anybody, can any one of my kids get a safe job? One's a firefighter, now one's going to be a policeman. And I'm going, did I give birth to a couple of adrenaline junkies? I don't know. But um, I'm excited for both of them because they're going to do what they love. Uh, it took Blake a little bit longer. Um, he's still taking college classes and I I'm, I'm going to be on his butt to finish his degree. So um, hello, Florina Color Life. I'm sorry I missed you coming in. Um, so yeah. Uh, hi, Emily. Welcome, welcome. Fireflies in the house. So, ah, yes, Robin, it just popped up on my phone. I just noticed that. So Lindsay, Emeralds and Fairy Lights and Diamonds and Washi and I got the three QVC bundles for this go round. So yeah, go watch those videos after this. So yeah, um, exciting. Do you see what I mean? My life makes me ADD, but um, excited for my kids. They're doing what they love and um, I couldn't be more proud of them. And I, and I told Blake, I said, you just, you chose to be a detective. Well, you are as nosy as they come and that's perfect. And by the way, you will be able to tell if anyone is lying or anyone is hiding anything because you were a master at it in high school. So he was laughing at me, but uh, I, I'm very, very proud of them. I just pick a safe job. Oh my gosh. So anyway, it is what it is. I want, you know, I always told them their whole life, do what makes you happy. You're going to be doing it for your whole life. So make sure you love your job and have a passion for it. So I'm, I'm happy that they, they do. So yeah. Hi, Tijuana Crafter. I know. Yeah. Jeannie, I'm telling you, 
a bunch of adrenaline junkies, seriously. Um, you know, I'm just, you know, I was just a principal. There, there was, there were a few times when I was a little, uh, you know, but most of the time it was pretty safe. Um, no plumbers, no. Veronica's here, Sapphires and Ocean Waves. Hello, friend. Hello. Welcome, welcome. So, yeah, I'm excited for them. Um, but, yeah, I'm excited for Alyssa. Oh, she has been working, working, working like lots and lots of hours. So I'm so happy that she is enjoying her much needed break. So what are you guys working on? Um, how are your Dakota paintings coming? Um, I'm super excited. Um, oh, it's so hard for me not to talk right now, I, but I, I'm just excited. That's all I will say. All I will say, just read between the lines. I'm just very excited for future endeavors. Let's just say that. Um, what are you guys working on Dakota wise? Uh, put up what you're working on. Um, I did, uh, tell, I don't know. Rochelle's not in here. Rochelle is, um, working late, so she won't be in here, but, um, Snow Tiger Bubbles and Chelsea. Oh, you're on the Oh, I know Joe. Isn't the crab so fun? I love that. Doing Pegasus Capricorn. Virgo. I got the new Dakota painting and I have an appointment with Rochelle because I am blinging up that tree and those butterflies, blinging it up. And Sue Bell, who is in here, can put bubbles on a painting like no other. Sorry, Sue, I'm shouting you out, but um, she has bubbles put in um, different areas of a painting that she's doing and it's beautiful. So I'm just like getting ideas on what I'm going to do with that cherry blossom tree. So yeah. Okay. Let me scroll back up because people have commented. Uh, I know secrets kill you. Well, you'll find out soon enough, I promise, but it's really exciting. It's fun. Um, almost almost Sagittarius finished tonight and get up. Hey, you, you decided on Hazel's world. Oh, it's so cute. Mystery diamond painting, majesty, working on Leo, lots of Leos. Okay. Uh, dimensions, Eden. I tell you what, um, Kat put up her kid up of Eden and I've done Eden. Is it wrong of me to be jealous of those of you doing Eden? I've never done a diamond painting twice, but I would do Eden again in a heartbeat. That was such an awesome canvas to do. Um, it was super fun. So Kim, enjoy every minute of it. Oh, yours is going to be here tomorrow. Uh, Leopard Leatherworks is working on pens. <laughs> what else do you do? Yes. Oh, um, we need the enhancement list. Yes. Yes, we do. No pressure. I don't, um, I don't know if Cheryl is in here or not. We need the enhancement list for the, you know, people have already asked Cheryl, are you going to do the enhancement list for the cherry blossom tree? I hope so. Um, Let's see. Carrie, keep those pens coming. Oh, yeah, absolutely. Um, working on getting the RV ready. So we, oh, you're leaving on Sunday, Michigan or bust. Oh, that's so exciting. Yeah, we're getting so close to the retreat. How many days? Let me count. Let me count. So let's see. We have an event on the 27th of April. And I was like, I don't know that I can go, Marlon. I've got my retreat. It's the next weekend. So we are going to be, okay. So today is obviously the 15th because it's tax day. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 16 more days. Oh, I'm excited. I am excited. I am flying into Chicago and driving into Michigan with Sue Layden. Um, it's going to be a fun, fun retreat. And I get to see Sue Bell there and Marion, who's on here, is going to be my roomie. Oh, I'm so excited to see everybody. That'll be so fun. Um, let's see. So, yeah, you guys are just going to kind of take a little trip, huh? Christine, dreaming of being human. That's another one I'm jealous of. I love that one. Um, glass mermaid, self-portrait, but have a bad cold and not diamond painted. Oh, Tijuana Crafter, get well. 
Get well. Robin is working on saints. Next is close your eyes. Yeah, that's that's another one that's beautiful. This is Tim, everyone. So Tim, Carrie is resting peacefully. Okay. Oh, that's right. How, did everything go okay? I know she had um, a little bit of uh, surgery today. Did everything go okay, Tim? I hope so. I've been sending prayers her way. Uh, Marion, did you find Everest working on Pegasus? Ever oh no, Everest is still MIA. Oh no. <gasps> Another Caden is a canine mama is working on Eden. Oh, uh, thank you, Tim. I've been so worried about her all day. Hi, Brenda. Mama B Diamond Drilling is in the house. Um, Marsha, you guys are precious. It's why I work so hard for Carrie and the whole community. Oh, we love you so much. Leopard leather works. Yes. Went very well. Oh, good. Um, Florina, I don't think I am going live for the retreat. Well, it's not, um, I will be back to go live the day after the retreat. That's normally how it works. So, uh, I will leave that Sunday and my, my live isn't Monday, but normally, at retreats, they don't um, they don't like a lot of videoing at all, and rightfully so. Everybody's there to craft and have fun, and we don't do a lot to ourselves. It's just a big slumber party. Nobody worries about what they look like. It's just super chill and relaxed, and um, nobody wants to worry about somebody putting a video camera or a phone in their face and videoing them when they don't want to be videoed. So we really try to not, not video, uh, a whole lot. Um, we take pictures, you know, that kind of thing, but, um, I will be live. Um, I'm flying back. I will get home late Sunday night, um, after the retreat, but I'll go live that Monday. Of course, I've got to tell all y'all, all of you how it went. So yeah, I'm so glad the surgery went well, Tim. That's awesome. Just got the new Dakota. Yay. Hugs for hiccup. Um, Emily, the the retreat that I'm going to uh, at the beginning of May is Mingle in the Mitten. And that one is in Michigan. And I'm excited. I signed up for horseback riding. I get to ride a horse. So I do love horseback. I Believe me, I am not an, an equestrian by any stretch of the imagination. But um, I love to ride, ride horses when I get a chance. So uh, it's going to be fun. Um, this coming weekend, um, I have been uh, I've been trying to eat right and be good, do a little bit of walking. Um, it is our drill team, high school drill team, fiftieth anniversary. Yes, I'm old. I need a facelift or eye cream or something. Um, I it's not been fifty years since. I was on the drill team. Don't make me any older than I am. But um, the drill team um, that I was on has been in existence for 50 years. So they invited all the alumni back and um, they've choreographed um, a dance that the alumni are supposed to participate in in the big spring show. So Saturday, um, there's a luncheon. Did she, did Brandy, did Brandy sneak in here? Oh, Brandy Styles. Okay. I'm so glad you're here. Welcome. Welcome. Um, yes. First weekend of May. Uh, when did Dakota Thon start? I have Everest all kitted up. It started the beginning of April, but Alina, you can join in anytime. If anyone wants to join Dakota Thon, all you have to do, there is a start thread in the Dakota Thon group. Don't just post it in the group as just a normal post. You have to go up to featured, find the start thread. We're leaving that thread open throughout the event. Post your start and then just jump in at the week we're at. We're at week three. We're at week three now. So just post your progress in week three and you're eligible for the weekly prizes. So no problem. You can join in. Um, we want as many people joining as want to. So yeah, you're not late. So it's awesome. Um, so anyway, yes, I've been kind of getting in shape. So <laughs> the drill, the current drill team director, I could be her mother. I, I saw her. I'm like, okay, I, I'm, I have shoes in my closet older than you, but she's adorable. She's blonde and cute and fun. And, you know, I was that way too, back in the day. Um, but, uh, she, 
has choreographed this dance and she's got she's got it blocked into three groups okay first group is current spartan heirs and maybe people that graduated like five years ago the next group is the 90s group you know middle-aged you know the last group is the group i am we are apparently the geriatric group um, anyone that's the school opened Stratford High School, it's in, it's in Houston. The uh, that was my high school, Stratford High School. We were the Spartans, so the drill team was the Spartan Airs. Um, but the last group is the geriatric group, and that is the, the group that opened the school. Did it open in 70? Yeah, it's 74, so 50 years. God bless, can you believe? Anyway, um. So the 70s, the 70s were 50 years ago, really. Uh, so Stratford opened in 74. And so all of the Tim, 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 you are in trouble. Oh, my gosh. Treat money in the airport. You're so sweet. Thank you so much. Oh, my gosh. Yes. I don't know if anyone in airports researches what prices are in real life, but they they don't know in airports, they just jack them up so high, but thank you so much, Tim. You're so sweet. I appreciate it. Um, but, um, so anyway, yes, I'm in the geriatric group. So each group has its own little section that you perform in my group. I'm like, do you have no faith in us? Like if you are breathing and upright, you can do this. And I'm going there. I mean, the first group is doing grand jetés and turning and all this stuff. I'm like, this is our group. This is what my life has come to. So if I'm breathing and upright, I can, I can do this section of the dance, but yeah, that's, that's our, that's our section. And I'm like, it's great to be in the, in the geriatric group. I'll start eating dinner at four 30 in the afternoon. Oh my God. Anyway. So, yes, I, I'm feeling a little old, so I've been eating right. You know, uh, I, do, I still got to go find a dress, you know, because I, you know, want to look halfway decent to go. There's a luncheon on Saturday. Then we go to the school to rehearse this dance. And then we perform at the spring show on Saturday night. So it ought to be it ought to be interesting. That's all I got to say. So we'll see how that goes. Um, my sister, thank you for asking Marsha. Tim does rock. I'm telling you, he does. He really, really does. And we appreciate him more than he knows and Carrie as well. And I'm so glad Carrie came out of surgery. Well, um, no, I'm Sarah. I'm calling my group, the geriatric group. They're kind of treating us as though we're geriatric. It's like, we're not, I mean, come on, seriously. Anyway, huh? What, what Carrie, you don't fit in your old uniform. You know, I don't know if I have, if I fit in my old uniform because I had to turn it in when I, um, left the drill team, my favorite uniform. I'm not kidding. We did wear these and, um, they were not, and I was a stick in high school. I mean, I ate a Frito pie, two big chocolate chip cookies and a full sugar Coke every day at lunch. And I was olive oil. They thought it would be grand to put us in white unitards. White. A unitard is like a skin tight deal from your neck down to your ankles. It's a one piece thing in white. We looked like stay puffed marshmallow men. Seriously. And we had to wear them. I would never at this juncture try that on. My old uniform, no, I, I probably couldn't fit in it. I don't know. I've, I'm very lucky. I've pretty much been the same size a, a long time, but um, I probably wouldn't be able to fit in my, I mean, again, I was a toothpick in high school. So mm, just learn the routine and show them up. Oh my gosh. Dragon wing diamonds. Hi, I'm so glad you're here. You're never late. Um, let's see. Oh, did I not say hi to McKinsey? Hello, McKinsey. Welcome, welcome. Um, uh, my sister. So on to my sister. My sister is home. 
Um, she got to come home early. They thought they might have to um, have a feeding tube for her. They didn't. Um, she's able to drink stuff out of a straw. And she took a picture and sent it to me. Let me see if I can find it and I'll show you. You're going to, you are absolutely going to be amazed, amazed at this picture because I was picturing it so much differently than it came out. The scar is underneath her chin. So you can't even see where the incision was. She's healing well. We've been talking every day. She's really doing well. Um, let me see if I can find it. She's been sending me several. <laughs> Here's a blast from the past. She keeps, I think the painkillers are really working well. She keeps sending me rando pictures. So here's a blast from the past. That is my mother and my sister and I. Um, that's in the 90s. Yeah. Do you like the hair? I had big honking hair. I don't know what I was thinking with that hairdo, but there I was. Yeah, beautiful. Um, but she sent me a picture of herself. Sorry, that was just random. She's sending me pictures of like birthday parties and stuff. And I'm going from long time ago. Okay, so this is her. She has still got swelling and stuff. And you can tell that it's swollen, but the swelling's going to go down. You cannot, I, I was just shocked to get this picture. This is about a week post-op. Look at that. I think she looks incredible for a week post-op when they took out part of her jaw, had to put in a leg bone to reconstruct her jaw. I mean, unbelievable. Unbelievable. Believable. God is really, really good. He really, really is. Um, I'm just so thankful and she's thankful. Now, um, our next hurdle, our next hurdle is um, the, they took, like I said, they took a section of her jaw and re reconstructed. They took a, a bone out of her leg and reconstructed her jaw. She's waiting for the dental implants to go back in. So um, I know, doesn't she look great? I couldn't believe it. Exactly. No, no glitter, Tim. This was white, just a white spandex thing they made us wear. It was horrible. Ooh. Anyway, again, stay puffed marshmallow men. That's what we looked like. I looked like a six foot tall, gigantic stay puffed marshmallow man. But um, back to Malai, um, they did find... Um, there was a malignancy in the piece of jaw that they took out. So um, she, it's, it's a really cool story. Um, you know, again, uh, they just, they, they've scanned her, no other cancer anywhere in the body. It was just in that area and they got it. But just to make sure they are going to do some radiation and some chemo. And I get this message from her and she said, and I posted it, some of you probably saw it in the Diamond Art Club VIP group, because I just thought, this is why we do what we do. This is why we diamond paint. She, um, she has six weeks of radiation, five times a week, 30 session days total, and chemotherapy one time a week, six infusions. But she, so this is her little, she's doing a digital cancer journal, and she has this picture of my completed blueberry fairy. And she texted me and said, I don't know why, Kara, she said, but every day I look at that painting and she said, it's just, I just love it. She goes, I just feel like such a connection to it. And she said, I just, I'm going to look at it every day. And so I wrote her back and I said, it's yours. And she said, what do you mean? I said, I'm sending you the painting. And she said, I didn't want you to send me the painting. I said, the painting right now is in a portfolio under my bed. Who's enjoying it in a portfolio under my bed? Am I going to frame it? Maybe, maybe not. Nobody's enjoying it in a portfolio put under my bed. I said, I would rather send that painting to somebody that loves it and is going to appreciate it and enjoy it. And so I'm sending it to her and she's beyond thrilled. And, um, that's why, you know, sometimes 
we get so bogged down in the negativity and wham, 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 wham on, on everything that we forget why we're doing what we're doing. And that just some, some days just, again, God hits me with why I'm doing what I'm doing. That's why that is exactly why. And I don't know why she's resonated so much with, with that painting, but she has. So I'm going to send it to her. And she's like, I, she goes, she goes, I can keep it. <laughs> I said, yes, Malai, you can keep it. I said, yes. I said, it's going to be in a portfolio under my bed for I don't know how long. Yes, keep it. She's like, I'm putting it up on my wall immediately. I said, that's what I hope you do with it. And I hope you enjoy it. And I said, that's why I do what I do. And I said, I just, you know, again, it's, it's, that's why we do it. So um, just a good reminder of, you know, why we do what we do. So, and, and I blinged the crud out of that. So um, she, sh she should enjoy it. So that was a, a happy story from this week. And um, I'm happy to send that to her. So yeah, Robert. Hi, Robert. Good to see you. I'm so glad you're here. I know it has been a long time. I hope you're, I hope you're doing well. Hope you're doing well. So, um, well, it is 641. Shall I do some announcing of names? Okay. Hello, Chaotic. Welcome, welcome. So glad that you are here. Okay. I have the names of the winners that we drew as a committee. I want to preface th these names being um, said by saying the entire committee meets every Sunday. We double check every single person in the spreadsheet and then we put the names on a wheel and we spin it and the name that comes up is the winner. Four of us are in there. We don't make Dakota come. We figure she's got better stuff to do. <laughs> but um, anyhow, so here we go with winners. Now, we still have a couple of people from last week that haven't claimed their prizes. We need you to claim them on a weekly basis. And you know me, I am as forgiving as I can possibly be. But because this event is so big and because we are dealing with a lot of stuff and, and mailing so much and all of that, um, we don't have time to chase people down. We just really, really don't. So please make sure that if you win the prize that you claim it. And I don't know if Kat is in the chat from England. She may be asleep. Maybe she'll watch this on replay. I don't know. But I got the shipping straightened out because she's in the UK. So uh, I will email you, Kat, with all that information. No worries. You're down. We're going to figure that out. And it's, well, it's actually figured out. So here we go with the names. Anyway, that, that suffice it to say it's fair and square and you guys need to claim your prizes within the week. We don't have time to chase people down and send you personal messages and all of that. Um, there's just not enough time to do it. And guys, please help your friends. If you hear somebody's name being announced and you know they're not in here, please help them out. Tell them. And I will post these names also in the Dakota Thon, um, on the Dakota Thon Facebook page so everybody knows who won. I think that's very helpful as well. Cause I mean, you know, life happens. Sometimes people can't get into the lives. I totally get it. Okay. Robert said I'm doing, Oh, I was in Toronto for a week. Went to see the blue Jays. Oh, how nice. Oh, I've got to get to Canada. Oh, thank you so much, Tammy. That's so sweet. I'm, I'm so thankful that you're doing that. That's awesome. Uh, won't be here long. Oh, Wanda. I hate migraines. I hope I hope it gets better for you. I get them too. They're terrible. Um, anyhow, for my birthday. Oh, Robert, that's awesome. What a nice birthday present to visit Canada. Okay, so here we go. We have two. Two. Our sponsors are amazing, by the way. One of them is in here and is always in here supporting and loving on us, as well as a lot of others. Um, we don't do what we do without our sponsors. And I say this and I'm going to say it and I'm not going to apologize for it. Go to the sponsor list on the Dakotathon page. Patronize those sponsors. They're the ones that are getting us the prizes. They're the ones that are supporting this diamond painting community and giving of their time, giving of their um, 
their finances, giving of their products. We need to support those businesses. We just do. Um, all right. So the first prize is a $20 Firefly gift card. Some of these prizes, I'm like, why can't I win? <gasps> the winner of the first $20 Firefly gift card is Chris Brummond. Is Chris Brummond in the house? Chris, you have won the $20 Firefly gift card. Congratulations. Also, if I have not said it, no, I know I haven't said it. Um, email me, theprincipalpainter at gmail.com, and I will uh, give you information on what to do to get your prizes. Okay, so $20 Firefly gift card, Chris Brummond. But wait, there's more. We have another Firefly $20 gift card. That one is going to... Robin Pennington. Congratulations, Robin Pennington won the other $20 Firefly gift card. All right. Now, on some of these prizes, I have show and tell. I miss doing show and tell. Um, so I just, I pulled some stuff to show you. The next prize is a Zodiac Shadows drill grinder. These came out so pretty. Look at that. And for those of you not familiar, a drill grinder, you can see the little things you, you well, this side. You If your drills are sticking together, you pour your drills in here, you put the top on and, and twisty, twisty, and it unsticks your drills. But look at the front and Zodiac Shadows did these for us, uh, for, obviously for the event. That's why I'm saying go show these, go show these sponsors some love and patronize them. The Zodiac Shadows uh, Drill Grinder. That prize goes to Colleen Kazin. Colleen, congratulations. I will be sending you out that drill grinder from Zodiac Shadows. Welcome uh, or uh, congratulations, congratulations. Thank you. <laughs> Alyssa is celebrating the end of tax season and continuing to mod this group. I love you, Alyssa. Thank you so much for all of your help. Oh my gosh. Oh, Robin Pennington is in the house. Yay. Congratulations, Robin. Okay. We now have a $15 coupon code to DP with sparklers. The first coupon code for DP with sparklers goes to Betty Hodge. Congratulations, Betty. Uh, we will get with you on and get you that uh, code for $15 gift card. Congratulations. I need a $15 DP with sparklers gift code. I've got to buy all that bling for my cherry blossom tree. Hence, I cannot, um, I cannot. Okay, so Betty Hodge is our first winner of our $15 gift card. Our second $15 DP with sparklers gift card winner is Nora Dixon. Congratulations, Nora. Congratulations, my gold. Drills from Year of the Dragon were so stuck awful. That drill grinder will be handy. Oh, good. All right. So Betty Hodge and Nora Dixon have won the two $15 gift cards to DP with sparklers. But wait, there's more. We're, we're, we're just getting warmed up. We have a cover minder from B&C Creations. Hang on just a second. Oh, Nora's in the house. Congratulations, Nora. Have fun buying your bling. Like I said, I need that gift card. I'm going to go get um, a cover minder. It won't be this cover minder, but I'll show you an example of what BNC Creations does with their cover minders. Hang on. I, I'm ill prepared on this front. One second. Talk amongst yourselves. I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. So B and C creations, these are just examples. These are not the prizes. These are mine and I'm not giving them up, but I just want to show you the examples of these adorable. These are the kind of cover minders that she does. And so the winner will get one of these cover minders. I'm not sure what it will be. These are just examples, just examples. Okay. 
So the winner of the cover minder from BNC Creations is Maricor Hernandez. Congratulations, Maricor Hernandez. Congratulations. Yay. Okay. Remind me to message. Okay, Emily, message me after the live. I will try to remember. <laughs> okay. Then we have from Putty Crocker, um, the next couple, uh, the next, well, the, the putty on uh, that we're giving away for Dakotathon is kind of hard to get. So the winners are lucking out because I, I miss these putty drops all the time. So um, this is uh, a for a putty crocker putty. Um, and that winner is Julianne Lachant. Congratulations, Julianne. That is awesome. So you get some Putty Crocker putty. Um, I have tried Putty Crocker uh, putty and it's it's awesome. I've actually tried both of the putties that uh, we are giving away for prizes during Dakotathon and they're both awesome. All right, is Barb Tope in the house? I see Debbie Rice in the house. Is Barb Tope in the house? Debbie, is Barb here? Is she here? I'm looking to see if she's responding or here. Hmm. I don't know if Barb is, but Barb, um, Barb Tope, we owe Barb a, oh, Barb Tope is here. Hi, Barb. Um, we owe some individuals in this chat, um, Barb Tope being one, she has donated um, paintings, two Dakotathon paintings, and for grand prizes, Dakotathon gift baskets um, that people are absolutely going to love. The first painting that Barb Tope donated, and we're giving it away tonight, Hugs for Hiccup. It is still in the plastic. Uh, so this is um, the first diamond painting that Barb has donated. And we are giving that particular prize. Congratulations and thank you so much, Barb. Um, that winner is Odine Lawrence. Congratulations, Odine Lawrence, for winning the Hugs for Hiccup diamond painting. Yay! Oh, people are like, oh my gosh. Yes, uh, sometimes, you know, we, we miss paintings. I, I have not missed a Dakota painting, but, you know, sometimes we do. So um, hopefully Odine Lawrence will love Hugs for Hiccup. And thank you so much for your donation, Barb, Barb Tope. Her bestie, Debbie Rice, has also donated. We're not giving it away tonight. We're, this is a, a grand prize, but Debbie Rice has donated an Everest diamond painting, but wait, she has also donated the entire enhancement pack for Everest. That is going to be a grand prize. So Barb and Debbie, we love you and thank you so much for, for all of that. That's amazing. Okay, going on. Mon Cherie Crafts, for those of you Hi, Sue. Welcome. Did you just sneak in here or did I miss saying hi to you? I'm sorry if I did. Sue Layden is in the house, my traveling buddy for the retreat. Uh, Monchery Crafts. I love their stuff. So this is what I've kitted up. Okay. So this is just a boring label with the number 51 on it and a Sharpie that I've done. Monchery Crafts has stickers that... Um, correspond not only with the color of the DMC drill you are working with, or if you're a cross stitch or DMC floss you're working with, you could use the stickers for either cro uh, cross stitch or diamond painting. Um, it has the DMC code on it. Um, they have round stickers for round drills, square stickers for square drills. It just really helps you organize really, really well. The stickers are amazing. Um, they stick to containers really well. They come off really well. They don't wear off uh, when you're using them. So um, Mon Cherie, thank you so much for um, your $25 gift card. So when you go on, you can pick out the labels that you would like from Mon Cherie Crafts. And who did we draw for the $25 gift card to Mon Cherie Crafts? I thought this was very appropriate. The winner is Barb Tope. 
Barb Tope, you've won the $25 gift card to Moncherie Crafts. Congratulations. Yay. Okay. Our next prize. Oh my gosh. I'm so glad I started when I did. It's almost time to get off of here. One law. I don't have the tray um, because she is going to send this out directly. One large tray from Lady K Creations. Lady K Creations has donated a large diamond painting tray. The winner of the Lady K Creations large diamond painting tray is Janka Stefankova. I think I'm pronouncing that right. Janka, I'm so sorry if I mispronounced your name. Janka Stefankova. So congratulations. Yanka, it's spelled J-A-N-K-A. So that is awesome. You've won a Lady K Creations large tray. Okay. The next prize. These are mine, but Kokisha will mail you yours directly should you win. It is a prize bundle. It is not only a Dakotathon 2024 tumbler. It comes with the Dakotathon 2024 journal with the logo from this year and the year and everything. So you get both of these in this prize pack. The winner of the Kokisha Tumblr from Butterfly Kisses, that is her business, from Butterfly Kisses, the Tumblr and journal winner is Ash Jordan. Congratulations, Ash. That is awesome. You won. Kokisha will get that to you. But again, all of the winners need to email me. The last prize that I have for tonight is a, um, I hope all of you saw Piper's uh, picture from last week. Um, this category is near and dear to my heart. Um, it's the kids category. Um, we've got some awesome kids participating in this uh, event. Uh, we like getting kids involved in crafting with us. And um, we've got a lot of kids working hard uh, on their creations. And so I am sending out a prize pack and I kind of wait. Um, I don't show what I've purchased because I, I sometimes wait to see who wins before I purchase the prize pack. If it's a boy, if it's a girl, the age, all of that, because I want to get age appropriate prizes. And the winner of the prize package that I'm going to send out, it's just a bunch of fun stuff for your age. Don't worry. I, I get it. Um, I, I have been a principal at both the elementary and the junior high level. So I, I get the age span here. The winner of my kid prize pack that I will be sending out to you is not, uh, is the one and only Zoe. And she is the daughter of Sam Patterson. So congratulations, Zoe. You get my prize pack. I will be mailing your prize pack to you. I, I'm having so much fun shopping for these prize packs. So Zoe, you're the winner. Congratulations. All right, guys. That is it. We made it. We made it through all of the prizes. And um, it is about time for me to uh, get off of here. I want to thank everybody for being here. It's so exciting to see everybody. Um, I am so sorry. Lisa, hello. Lisa Noof, hello. I didn't say hi. And then I saw, uh, I hope I said hello to Karen and Nora. Oh, I just hate not saying hello to people that are on here, but sometimes they just get by me. Um, and I want to thank everyone for, for being on here and um, for your support of Dakotathon. We're having a great, great time. Um, but again, the I will tell you this morning, Brandy posted the threads. There's three threads. There's a week three diamond painting thread. There's a week three cross stitch coloring and uh, painting thread. And there's a week three kid thread. Make sure you're posting your appropriate picture in one of the threads. So if you're a diamond painter, post your diamond painting in the diamond painting thread. If you're a cross stitcher, post in the cross stitching thread. And if you are in, if you are a child, post, or have your parent or you, depending on parent permission, post in the kid thread. So um, those of you, like I've said before, but I, I just continue to say it. So um, hopefully it's helpful to some people. If you just post it just outright in the group. 
Um, it's nice for all of us to look at, but that's not entering you for the weekly prizes. So you got to go into the thread and post under the appropriate thread. So um, if you heard anybody's name that won, please feel free to notify them and have them email me. I will put my email when I post this latest group of winners in the Dakotathon page. Um, yeah, you guys, uh, love you guys too. Have a great night. Remember Brandy is not going live tonight cause uh, she was having a bit of car, car trouble, but, um, I will see you back here, uh, next week and I'll, I'll let you know how my drill team reunion went. Uh, that should be really interesting. Uh, anyway, um, we'll see if I made it through my dance without having a, an ambulance call. We'll, we'll see. Anyway. <laughs> All right, guys, I will see you next week. Thanks as always for being here. I love spending time with you guys and have a great night and I'll see you next week. Bye.